Hi, my name is Alex Hay. I'm a sophomore at Colorado State University, and this is my daily routine during finals week at home. All right, this is an extremely accurate representation of me waking up in the morning. I wake up at about 6.30. Uh, no, I'm lying. I don't wake up at 6.30. I actually wake up a lot later. Uh, probably to be more accurate and realistic, I wake up around 9.30, 10. Absolute earliest, though. All right, so once I am woken up, I walk out of my room, usually greeted by my dog who's up there waiting for me. She's waiting for me to get ready. Then I go, I get some breakfast. Uh, today it was a tasty pear, so I went and I ate that. And now it is time to run. Alright, run with the dog is out of the way. Now I usually head to the local rec center and uh, get a workout in with weights. It's about uh, 1, 1.30 ish. Basically the rest of the afternoon uh, is probably gonna be dedicated towards doing my schoolwork. I'm very organized with it. It is finals week still. So I have a lot of study guides I have to get ready for and a lot of last assignments I have to wrap up. All right guys, so for this day in the life vlog, I will show you how I take notes and how I study. This is basically what I do for every final, and I do it during lectures, I do it during classes. Um, when we are back in in-person, this is the way I take notes. I've found it to be pretty effective. I also tutor this class for Colorado State University through the TILT program. So for this course, I give this strategy to all my students, and they like it, they all do it too. For every class, you are most likely gonna have learning objectives, especially for those lower level general classes, you're gonna have a lot of learning objectives. We'll go to week two. So week two's weekly course content is right here, and you can see right at the beginning you have learning objectives and things that she wants you, the professor wants you to know by the end of the week. And I like to say that if you can identify all of this stuff by the end of the week, then you're in good shape for an exam. And through every lecture, she also posts three questions for a study guide. So what I would like to do is I like to just highlight all of this and copy it over into a Word document. So this is this was my week one study guide for this exact course. And basically I have all of the questions from the study guide uh, copied and pasted in, and then my answers in red. Usually as the lectures progress, they go in order with the questions, at least for this class, which was really nice. So I needed to know what I was looking for next, and it really helped me um, get through every single week and then for example at the end of the year when you need a final study guide This is for another class I compiled all the information and all the questions onto one master document so that for the final I have something to study for all right So if I was in this class if I was in this week My workflow would basically look like copying and pasting all that into a word document And then I would minimize this and then bring it to the side here and then I'd have my word document here and I would basically just watch the lecture the origin and, the and answer my copied and pasted uh, learning objective questions right here. Basically this is my workflow for every single class. It's the way I take notes. Uh, it works for works for most people I've suggested it to, um, but there are a million different ways to take notes and work on exams, so I will not say that there is a one-size-fits-all for note-taking. All right, now for my favorite part of the night which is basically what I do every night when I'm at home, which is turning on my Xbox and playing Apex with my brother, two floors up. If you like the video, leave a comment, and as always, guys, thank you for watching.